you get the first one with the start up, starter pity timer in 10 packs, and then it's an average of 20 packs. Well, mage. What's it gonna be? Useful secrets you have, yes you do. I actually think I'll just coin the Nasmani. That will corrupt the inside. And I already have a raised it here. I can just bring the Nasmani back later. If the mage is even able to kill it. And if mage can't kill it, then well... That's a bit of a problem for you, isn't it? That could be the one that summons the water elemental. Cirilla, really? I don't want to summon a water elemental for the mage. Well, Cirilla. That's intriguing. I'm gonna, how do you feel about the new expansion? I'm I'm really undecided at the moment. I mean, playing these decks, it feels like completely foreign, but these are not the real decks now, are they? It's the Oasis, the secret, by the way. Might as well do a Devouring Plague here. I guess. Blood for the Blood God, Skulls for the Skull Throne. No, sorry, wrong universe. That's probably an Ice Barrier, isn't it? Now that I know some of the cards in these decks, it does, does change things. Void Flayer. Ooh, an Inner Fire. That's a nice card. Let's make a big minion. Blood for Gahoon. Sorry. Also killed that minion. Okay. Now have this nice 1440. Oh no, but the priest has freezes. Priest can actually kill this, by the way. <laughs> okay, Dave. See you around. Priest can actually, if they can't kill it, they can at least freeze it. Uh, it was not not a good idea to go all in on that. That was not a good idea. So now I just need to chill. But priest, I mean the mage has mage has a bunch of freezes in the deck, and now a snap freeze. Lost my beautiful blood weaver. Their hand is all secrets. Oh boy, it's all secrets. Always was. How do I deal damage? That's not very easy because as a priest I don't have any any real ways to deal damage. Huh. Give a minion plus three plus five. Well that that's damage. Shadow form is damage. Shadow form might be a little too slow though. Let's just do the fortitude. Okay, here we go. Still only one minion has died, so raised it is not very useful. Depresso Kitty has a question. Well, shoot. What is on your mind? Oh, 
Well, that was the second snap to freeze. But there's the tendon that's going to deal to damage to everything. That's coming eventually. I see the most chilling here. I could resurrect those minions. We'll see. Did you open Barons early? No, I, I haven't opened any packs. It's the Fireside Gathering here. You can you can do Fireside Gathering. That will allow you to play with the play with the de recipe decks. These guys are not very useful now, are they? Nope, nope, they are not. So I guess we're chilling. Finally, a second chance. No, more damage. And even more damage. Yeah, that's where it's dead. One, two, three, four, five spells in hand. I'm gonna do condemn in the void flare. That's fine. Go to 19. Do you know how? Well, when you're in a fireside gathering, you went at fireside gathering, it shows the, the symbol friendless looks like this. Then you just go to your packs and open them. That's still the secret that gives them the water elemental. I don't want them to have that. We will feed on this Ooh, a priest, Van I mean, they have the tendon, of course. Don't look away. So I need to chill for the time being. But once I kill the ten, then I mean, after that, the mage doesn't have much left, right? They have the full hero power already, so can they just slowly hero power their way through me? No, the warden. Let's get a dragon. Murasund. Probably more like an evasive dragon it right. Let's get that one out there. Murasund doesn't activate the battle cry effects, so it's not that useful. Here comes the Mordrish. The thing is that Mordrish doesn't kill me. And when it doesn't kill me. That means that I can use Xyrella. One Desperate Prayer is enough, right? That was 10 healing, that's 10 damage from Xyrella already. I believe that's enough. What knowledge do the stars provide? I can also do the Priest. Nice. Like this. And the Mage, does the Mage have something left? I mean, I guess they have another Reckless Apprentice. Oh, and the Wound Thieves. Wound Thieves might be ugly. Ah, <laughs> close-up gamer. Yeah, sure. A Pixie's Blast. Ouch. Ouch. I think I need to do Blade Master. I think I have to. I hear and obey. No way Sally will show up, but that's totally fine. It's going to take a bunch of damage from the Blade Master. And then I can do a Devouring Plague to kill it. And I can heal myself. <laughs> and all of a sudden I'm still at 17. But they still have one Reckless Apprentice left and a Fallen Hero left. They could deal a bunch of damage here. We'll see. Like two underpowered decks just just slapping frantically at each other. That's what this looks like. I 
kind of need to kill that, right? I suppose this one will has, has, have to get into it. Let's play another priest. Now, now we have seen both both reckless apprentices. Finally. Even if I had healed this, it could still be killed by that 4 damage. And this one cannot be killed by it. Oh no! It's new secrets! That's 11 damage. It was a counter spell. I'll give this a try. Mage is down to 2 health. No more ice barriers. Warden's gone. <laughs> like, <laughs> the, the, these underpowered decks just hitting each other slowly, slowly over time. That's another Oasis ally. Ah, but the light shower is here. <laughs> they have a wand thief, but they don't have anything to combo it with. Yep, that's the wand thief right there. Oh boy. The games. The games are... <laughs> I don't even know what these games are. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel for more.